May 6th. Dawn breaks, clear and calm. Then, without warning, the wind rises. Its pattern is unpredictable. doesn't drop today, I will have to go back to Camp 3 to get back into condition. And it will take another week to bring up supplies. In a cairn built of rocks, I offer to the Mother Goddess the names of the dead Sherpas and a mirror, symbol of the soul of man, placed so that the mount can see her own reflection. It is a gentle ceremony in the face of such violence. Suddenly, the wind begins to abate. Eight thousand feet below, the control center gets ready. It looks skewable. There's no way to know what the wind is like. If it's behind me, the chute may not open. Six seconds from the start, the speed will be over 100 miles an hour. White snow where rocks stick out. Mixed snow and ice down to small rocks. Below that, 90% ice. Then the Bergschund. There's no way to pause. Nothing comforting. No escape. 